Hello friends and welcome back to another week of virtual story time with Miss Liz. So this week I have tons of new books and I think we'll do another theme this week. Oh, Oscar wants to say hello. <laughs> so this week's theme is things that go. So today and for the rest of this week, we're going to be reading books about things that go. Things like bikes and cars and trucks. We might even have books about ice cream trucks and fire trucks. So if you like things that go or you know someone that does, you know you should be tuning in this week to see some more great books. Now, today's book is about my favorite way to get around, which is on a bike. This is a wonderful book called Doc on a Bike by David Shannon. This is a book that's published by Scholastic. Thank you, Scholastic. Duck on a Bike by David Shannon. Wow, look at that cool red bike. It looks like we're on a farm and there's some other animals too. Who do you see back here? It's a pig. And of course, the star of the book here, quack quack, is the duck. And how about all the way over here, eating some grass? Moo, it's a cow. So I think we'll meet even more animals in this book, maybe even a dog. What do you think about that, Oscar? I think he's pretty excited. Let's read. One day down on the farm, Duck got a wild idea. I bet I could ride a bike, he thought. He waddled over to where the boy parked his bike, this red bike, and he climbed on and he began to ride. At first, he rolled very slowly and he wobbled a lot, but it was fun. Duck rode past Cow and waved to her. Hello, Cow, said Duck. Moo, said Cow, but what she thought was, a duck on a bike? That's the silliest thing I've ever seen. Then Duck rode past Sheep. Hello, Sheep, said Duck. Bah, said Sheep. But what she thought was, he's gonna hurt himself if he's not careful. Duck was riding better now. More practice makes better. And he rode past Dog. Hello, Dog, said Duck. Woof, said Dog. But what he thought was, that's a mighty neat trick. Then Duck rode past Cat. Hello, Cat, said Duck. Meow, said Cat. But what she thought was, I wouldn't waste my time riding a bike. You know, cats like to lay and nap a lot. I can tell you that that's what my cats like to do. Duck pedaled a little bit faster and he rode past horse. Hello, horse, said duck. Me, said horse. But what he thought was, you're still not as fast as me, duck. <laughs> Duck rang his bell, ding, ding, as he rode toward Chicken. Hello, Chicken, said Duck. Quack, quack, said Chicken. But what she thought was, watch where you're going, Duck. Oh my goodness, it looks like Duck is riding straight towards Chicken. But she's fine. Then Duck rode past Goat. Ooh, Goat is eating some trash. I think goats like to eat a lot of strange things. Duck said, hello, goat. Ma said goat. But what he thought was, I'd like to eat that bike. <gasps> eat a bike? That is silly. <laughs> Duck stood on the seat. Wow, look at that doing tricks now. And rode past pig and pig. Boink, boink said pig and pig, but what they thought was, duck is such a show off. <laughs> what are they doing right now? You see what they're doing? <gasps> they're laying in the mud. That's called wallowing. 
Pigs love to wallow in some mud. <gasps> then Duck Road, no hands, passed Mouse. Hello, Mouse, said Duck. Squeak, said Mouse. But what he thought was, I wish I could ride a bike just like Duck. Suddenly, a whole bunch of kids came down the road on bikes. They were in such a hurry that they didn't see Duck. They parked their bikes by the house and they went inside. <gasps> now there's a lot more bikes around. What do you think is gonna happen next? <gasps> Look, all of the animals are noticing the bikes. Here is cow and cat and sheep and chicken and mouse and dog and horse and pig and pig and goat. Do you think they want to give it a try? Let's see. Oh, wow! Now all the animals had bikes. They rode around and round the barnyard. This is fun, they all said. Good idea, duck. Wow, do you see that? Isn't that so cool? Chicken is on a tricycle. Pig and pig are on a tandem bike. That is a bike made for two riders. Oh, wow, that is so neat. Oops, looks like goat took a bite out of that basket. Munch, munch, munch. Mm. Then they put the bikes back by the house and no one knew that on that afternoon there had been a cow, a sheep, a dog, a cat, a horse, a chicken, a goat, two pigs, a mouse, and a duck on a bike. The end. Wasn't that a fun story? I love that duck inspired the other animals to try something new. Now, some of you might have bikes at home, do you? I ride my bike almost every day. I don't have my own car and sometimes I need to get around and it's too far to walk. And I try to ride my bike whenever I can. And if you have a bike and if you are looking to become a better rider, if you just practice, you can definitely improve your biking skills. I think biking is something that almost anybody can enjoy. So thank you for joining me today for another virtual story time. And remember, for the rest of this week, we're reading all books about things that go, cars and trucks and more. So I'll see you next time for another great book. Thanks for tuning in. Oh, and Oscar wanted to say thank you for joining us. I think that book put him to sleep. Thanks, everybody.